<laughs> that's not what I say. I say hi guys. <laughs> but anyway. Oh, you guys don't know yet. So we're having a baby. <laughs> what a so you guys don't know yet. We're having a baby. And um, we had a friend make us this cake and uh, we're going to cut it today with our family and friends on the phone and everybody will be joining in and watching us cut the cake so we can find out if it's a boy, whatever. Oh, a girl. I'm team girl. Always. I'm, I'm sorry. Team boy. <laughs> but yeah, are you excited? I'm so anxious. I feel like I'm sweating. Can you guys see me sweat? I'm sweating. My face is hot. I'm too healthy. I'm too healthy. Whatever it is. Healthy. I'd be happy with a boy. I'd be happy with a girl. A princess. Yeah. It's just that, you know, can you imagine playing dress up? The little cutie. <laughs> <laughs> Running around. I think that's what I'm most excited for. Like having yeah. a mini me or a mini me yeah, yeah, yeah. running around the house. Definitely love me. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. So we're gonna have you guys come along with this journey because again, your family and friends. So um, yeah, we'll be cutting this cake together, and I'm so excited. Thank you, baby. <laughs> Thanks for putting a baby in me. <laughs> Too much TMI. <laughs> TMI. to the channel I haven't been here in a while and this is gonna be like my first vlog coming back in a while and there's going to be some news dropping in here but I'm gonna tell you all of this while I get ready it's my partner's birthday today and we're getting so excited to um, you know what let me close this window because it's kind of getting loud and I can hear outside <laughs> okay um, it's my partner's birthday and we're getting ready to go to dinner and yeah so we're gonna catch up but also just talk about life and the reason why you know I haven't really been like showing up here so much is that um, it gets hard okay it gets hard showing up here especially because I think I was dealing with a lot of like personal issues where it was more kind of like imposter syndrome where I felt like do I even belong here like what am I doing like honestly but like it took me a while to finally understand that I was really mostly just doubting myself and not that there was anything to doubt myself for it's like I'm afraid to be seen. I'm afraid that people would see me for me. But I turned 30 in 12 days. Like, if this isn't where I accept myself for who I am and stop caring about what other people think or how I speak or how um, I look, even like 
it shouldn't be a big deal so like one of the main reasons why I haven't showed up is that and I just wasn't feeling like myself like earlier in 2023 I went through a lot like I lost my little brother it was a very heart-wrenching time and I felt like I kind of internalized and tried to make sense of a lot of my feelings of my grief instead of actually feeling it so and I think at the end of the year is when everything just came crashing down where I had no energy whatsoever to you know to hold a conversation to do anything like I couldn't film I just felt like I had to get through what I needed to get through if you guys understand up oh, I forgot a very important part of my eyebrows but it's okay um yeah I'll just do it at the end yeah so that was it so it was just a lot that I was going through and I completely just needed to have that time alone rather than trying to push myself to film it was more about you know what let me live the life that I'm living right now let me try and feel it and then I'll come back to YouTube you know when I feel like I'm strong enough that I could come back so here I am I think I posted a, a video like two weeks ago but it was like a <laughs> it was a throwback it was like a date night that I had filmed for a while and I finally just posted it but another reason why I haven't been on YouTube, which is actually good news, is that um, I am having a baby. <laughs> um, you could tell, man, by my chest, my neck, I've never broke out this much in my whole life. And whenever I ask the doctor, and she's like, oh, it's just a lot of hormones, like you're producing a lot more oils and stuff like that. So it makes a lot of sense why you would be breaking out a lot more than um, than usual. So I was like, you know, I'll take that. It's not that big of a deal. Like it's just, you know, oh, hi Bentley. Look at this. I can't film anything without somebody showing up in my, um, in my frame. So that was it. I think that's the good news. It was more that I am preggers. I'm pregnant and I am, expecting a little girl yeah so it was a lot i was so tired like during my first trimester like and also all of my emotional things that i was dealing with like there was no youtubing for me like i was still basically living life but i think that's all i had the energy for so i got a vanity i bought like a dining room table dining room set i bought the couple chairs so um I'm not nesting just yet I'm just like making the home feel more like a home so that way when the baby comes I'm not so worried about certain things like where are we gonna sit to have dinner so yeah that was it thank you for spending a little bit of time with me and catching up with me just letting you guys know okay I don't know why I'm trying to cover these no point no point it's too many okay I'll do my face which is like insane because I have to do it all. I've never done this all over my face before. It's always like on little, tiny little dots. But I feel like now my entire face needs to be covered. Like what? And then all I hear is that, oh, it will go away after you give birth. I know, I want it to go away right now. You have no idea how happy I've been the past like couple months granted like I was sick I was so tired I was okay like now I'm in the second trimester so it's not so bad but let me tell you the first trimester was it was humbling like it took me a while to get like back to myself okay but so worth it like I'm actually so happy like I don't want to smile too much and crease my makeup and stuff but I think we've been wanting this for so long and now that it's happening it's like it's unreal it just feels so magical 
and every time I'm like look at look down at my belly I'm like oh my goodness I'm having a baby girl and John's over here like he can't wait to be a girl dad he can't wait for daddy daughter dances and like okay this is something real this is a real thing and I don't know I'm excited I'm happy and I don't know I wanted to tell you guys this and bring you along to uh, the intense ritual we're about to get into because it's going to be intense we have like so much planned like we did like a very intimate gender reveal but I know for sure the baby shower won't be that way like uh, I can't wait to show you guys the yoga that I do just specifically for pregnancy and um, yeah like all the workouts that I do and just showing you guys um, it's the same exact vlog it's just that I have to now add pregnancy at the end of it because it just I don't know that's my personality now so anytime I'm doing something I always have to say uh, I hope every time I do something oh wow well, every time I do something I always have to like add pregnancy at the bottom like going on a hot girl walk while pregnant <laughs> going on a this while pregnant cooking while pregnant I don't know it's a new personality and I'm truly enjoying it right now like now that I have the energy and I have my mental capacity back like let me tell you I was a zombie the first trimester I don't know how I made it to be honest but now all my energy is back I want to run around the world run marathons just I don't know and I'm taking advantage now because I know and I've actually heard that it gets worse um during the third trimester like the last leg of it all is when it's gonna get hard so I'm trying to pace myself just taking it one day at a time and yeah maybe I should stop talking about that now <laughs> let's talk about getting ready for dinner we're going to this restaurant for john's birthday he doesn't know because i picked it i just told him that you know what type of food it was and he loves like asian fusion so for sure he's gonna love it i just told him oh my gosh it's asian fusion and stuff so he's excited i'm excited i'm excited to get cute and stuff can't wait for you guys to see my dress um, and how it fits. And when I wear it, you get to see my little bumpy bump. Little bump date. That's all I wanted to let you guys know. I'll see you after I'm done with my makeup. Okay, serving face. Don't even look like myself. From earlier, I had all this acne. But look at me now but yeah i'm wearing this dress from the brand sir it's like s-i-r here's the belly hi little baby just sitting pretty in this dress the back is out and it has this cute little like red thing it's like made out of like bone and stuff Ugh. I think it is so cute. But yeah, tis me. Okay. It's actually a very long dress, like all the way down to my ankles. Um one second, let me see if I can show you. You probably can tell what shoes I'm wearing with it. My only brown shoes.
my new favorite combo the past few days a couple months actually so you guys get to see how I feel my lips see I'm already smiling too much I have fairly big lips already so I try not to do anything that is sing straight them too much I got a nice little contour on the side. Birthday boy. Yeah. You wanna come tell the people how you feel? Uh, okay. Ooh, look at that. Okay, road. How you feel? How hey. does it feel to be 30? Show me your outfit. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Look at this. A market sweater. Right? All Saints t-shirt. All Saints pants. Some cute grown-up shoes. <laughs> okay, I see you. I see you. You look sexy, baby. Look sexy. You look dirty. Trying to keep up with you. You look like a girl dad. <laughs> <laughs> little babies. Little gold hoops. Oh, watch. It's my favorite one. I've had it for like a thousand years. And it always does the job. I'm not gonna put a necklace on just because of how high this is. I'm just gonna leave it alone. This is basically my necklace. <laughs> okay, and oh, well, this one doesn't fit because now my fingers are huge. Is that what this is? My gold Ferris ring. I guess on the other hand. 